Welcome to part two. This one is about product incremental change and all the changes that manufacturers go through to invigorate their sales. First of all, let's have a look at some of the changes a manufacturer could actually take part in. They might change the colour. They might change the form. Use the correct terminology, please, rather than shape. They might put a surface to, uh, design or decoration on. They might have some new technology in there, but they'd also have some minor modifications. All of those things, by the way, will reduce their costs. We'll talk about the advantages and the disadvantages to the manufacturer a little bit later. First of all, let's have a look at the reasons why a manufacturer would do this. Well, maybe they would want to use different materials. Maybe they would want to reduce their wages. All of those things would drop the price of the product, but to them. If it is a change of materials, they will be minor modifications. We're not talking about major changes here, just very minor product changes. If we use the phone as an example, they might have a better battery life. They might have a better camera. They might have a better screen size. All of those are very small, incremental changes. Tune in for part three when we'll look at the product life cycle.